In this second video we'll revisit the majestic landscapes of the Three Valleys in France and the magical city of Hyderabad in India, two amazing photographic locations and two opportunities to test out some compositional techniques when composing an image. In the last video we saw how getting in close was a great way to remove unwanted distractions and isolate a subject. In this short video I'm going to talk about three further simple techniques that I use. The first technique is the cornerstone of image making both in photography, painting and design for hundreds of years and is the so-called rule of thirds. Now imagine you divide your scene into three horizontal and three vertical sections by drawing two sets of equally spaced imaginary horizontal and vertical lines. If you place interest on the lines or points of intersection of those lines, you should achieve a well-balanced image. In this shot you'll see that the cable car sits on one point of the intersection on the top right, whilst on the left the pylon sits along one of the vertical lines. In the last video I mentioned that it was important to think about both foreground and background. In my mind the skis at the bottom right foreground work with the cable car in the background to balance this wintry scene. Well, maybe it's a little grand to call this a rule, but I certainly think the rule of thirds is a helpful guideline and maybe one rule you would want to periodically set out to purposely break. The next technique can be combined with the rule of thirds and is really simple. It is to be on the lookout for lines. Without thinking about it, we all need a way of navigating around a scene. This could be to draw our eye to the subject in the distance from something in the foreground of the shot, or alternatively the lines could form part of the interest and story in themselves. I was certainly intrigued by the shapes left in the snow from these skiers. And lastly, one of my favourite compositional techniques, to choose an interesting viewpoint to shoot your images. I'm actually a great fan of this technique because it means shooting from an alternative angle. It's so easy to take photos by standing up and shooting the world from eye level. If you can get up high or get down low, you start to see the world from a very different and more interesting perspective. What better way to see the hustle and bustle of Hyderabad from the top of the Charminar? This beautiful, global, iconic structure in Hyderabad was built in the late 1500s and provides some spectacular elevated views across the city. I've tried to capture fairly wide angle shots from above as well as zooming in and isolating my subject. And of course, I've had to try taking a slightly unusual image of the Charminar itself by getting down low and looking up using the natural lines of the railings that drew my eye from the foreground to the background. Back in the Three Valleys, look how these snapshots compare to a shot that's taken seconds later with the looking up technique in mind. So three compositional techniques, the rule of thirds, looking for lines and trying an unusual shooting angle.